All right, hey you guys, it's me Morgan and this is a super special video because this is my birthday hair video. And if you guys did not know, my birthday was last week. So it was Thursday, March 22nd and I turned 28 years old. 28 long years here. But yeah, so shout out to all the Aries out there. Um, I had a really good birthday weekend and whatnot and I just can't believe like I'm already 28 you know pushing 30 in two more years but you know I'm enjoying every minute of it so thank you everybody for all the birthday wishes and the shout outs and all that that I got on Instagram and snapchat and yeah so today I just wanted to make this video about my birthday hair because I got tons of questions about it. I got my hair done last Wednesday. So as you guys know, I basically do my own hair, but I wanted to treat myself this year and get my hair done for my 28th birthday. So that's what I did. I didn't want to have to worry about my hair, um, any of that. Okay, so first I'm going to go over who did my hair and then what hair I have because those are both very important. So um, I did get my hair done by Q the Braider and I found her because I watch Keisha Kaylee's videos, well, Keisha Anderson. I love her videos. She's from Atlanta too, so shout out to her. I'll link her um, YouTube below, but I saw that she goes there and I think her boyfriend gets his hair braided from her. So I always been looking for like a really good braider because um, I kind of want to experience the braid life, you know? So I saw um, her Instagram and I saw her work and I just like fell in love with a hairstyle and I was like, oh my God, I have to get this for my birthday. So this is the hairstyle right here. Um, so I have feed in braids and I have small braids. So um, today is Sunday and yeah, there my hair still looks very, very good, okay? So uh, I have two feed in braids on the side and then I have two small braids right here and then one in the middle right there. So I'll leave the Instagram to the girl who did my hair, cue the braider, she's great. Um, she's so sweet. She's nice. She's funny. We had a great time. She was quick and yeah, she is great. Okay, so moving on to this hair hunty. Like what hair did I use to achieve this style? So I did use like my favorite, her hair company. So her hair company is like my favorite hair company because I have been using their hair forever like this is not just some company that just came out of nowhere like they've been around so I've been using their hair forever like I think my first time I used it was like 2012 or something so it's 2018 that's like six years so I've been using them steady for six years and I absolutely love them I love their customer service I love their hair and all that so to achieve this style, it is best if you do use curly hair. So I did get three bundles of 20 inches um, for their curly hair. They have great bundle deals um, and specials going on. So I would definitely look into that. But not only are the bundle deals great with them, but the curly hair is bomb. Like, y'all, I have videos of their curly hair before and I still wear the wigs that I made with their curly hair and they are still going strong. So, um, if you guys seen the wig that I usually wear, the short, well, it's probably like right here, but it's like a curly flip over. That's from her hair company. And usually on Instagram, if I post like a picture, I will try to tag the company I use. So you guys know, but this is the 20 inches and this is the curly hair. They have regular curly and then they have kinky curly. So this is the regular curly and y'all, this is my favorite. I love it. It's super duper soft. So when I was getting my hair done by Q the Braider, she really liked the hair. She was like, what kind of hair is this? You know, where'd you get it from? Like it was bomb. And I'll try to put a picture in somewhere, maybe like right over here, uh, when I first got my hair done last week and the curls just looked bomb. Like when I got the hair, first I co-washed it in the shower, well, in the sink, in the water. But I first co-washed it and then I let it air dry and the goal, 
was to get my hair extra extra curly so what I did to achieve that since it's not a wig because usually when I have curly wigs I wash it and I um, define it with the dimming brush and I hang it up upside down and let it dry and scrunch it so it gets more like volume I can't really do that because these are bundles but after I washed it I did put it on a towel and I just like literally laid the bundle like flat down so that um, the curls would squish together as they were drying so after she did my hair my hair was very very bouncy as y'all saw in that picture like it was big bouncy and beautiful so it still is beautiful you know <laughs> but um yeah so that's how I achieve like extra curly looks with my curly hair you have to play with it you have to use your hands and scrunch it or use a diffuser to help define the curls. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys how um, the hair really is and how she did it and um, what else? Oh yeah, and how the original style looks. So before I get into that, I wanna show you guys the products I use on my curly hair from her hair company um, because it's very, very important because I get tons of questions on how do you, um, how do you care for your curly hair? How do you not make it, how does it not get frizzy? What do you use on it? So I'm about to tell you now, and it's very, very simple. So first of all, I use water. So um, since this is not a wig, this is a sew, sew a sewn in. This is a sew in, so the back is sewn in, and then I have a ponytail at the top. Um, I have to sleep in it, and I try not to sleep in my curly hair, but since this hairstyle does, consist of a sew-in I have to sleep in it so at night I just put it in a bonnet and then in the morning I take it and split it in half and then I'll take sections of it and I will just spray it with the water and make sure it's like really really damp and then I use my broken dimming brush so this is a dimming brush um, it's supposed to have a handle but I broke mine so I just use it like this um, I start from the bottom and I have to make sure the hair is like completely wet it does dry very very quickly which is a good thing so I just make sure it's completely wet comb through it and then I use this and y'all this is the bomb this is from not your mother's natural and it's royal honey uh, called I can't say that word um, desert melon but it's a repair protectant leave-in conditioner and I use this on my all my hair all my hairs on my real hair and on my weaves I use it for everything I love it um, I got this at Sephora not Sephora Target or Ulta they have it okay so I spray that on and then I use the brush again and brush it through so I do that to the whole head until it's all wet not dripping wet but like very very damp and the curls are defined and then I just scrunch it and then I literally just sit and let it air dry so you have to care for your hair like I feel like curly hair is easy to maintain but it's also high maintenance if that makes sense so like once your curly hair is like dry and stuff it looks like bomb anyway because it's curly hair and it's cute so you don't really have to like do anything else to it but if you don't care for it then it's going to get matted and tangled and that's with any curly hair that's the key you have to take care of it you cannot get curly hair and put it in your head and not care for it and not do anything to it and expect it to look perfect all the time no i literally do my hair every single day so every day i comb through this especially since it's curly and curls intertwine so I go through this every single day but it does dry quick it's not that long of a process so it's okay so uh, I'm going to show you guys so this back part is sewn in so from here all the way down is sewn in and like I said this is all 20 inches so this is sewn in and then this part she braided and then I have my bun here with my hair and then I, she just wrapped the third bundle around. So this is actually a whole bundle of hair. I look so weird like this. So this is a whole bundle of hair up here. So this could kind of help you see how big the bundles are. Um, so that's a whole bundle. So the original style was not this. I've just been wearing like this for the past couple days. But I'm going to put it into the original style right now. Okay, so the original style is a bun 
and it's half down so how I did it was I just take my hair like so and I twist it around like this in a circle and then you kind of just like twist and wrap at the same time uh oh did I pull some up oh, start over just kidding all right this is hard because I don't have a mirror in front of me I'm literally looking at the viewfinder up here okay so you just take it twist it and kind of like as you're twisting you're wrapping it around like this and you don't have to make it like perfect you can pull some of the hair and I just take a hair tie and put it in like that and then you can like play with it to um piece of my hair <laughs> you can play with it to get it to however you want it to look okay so um I like to like pull some pieces of hair out just so it's not like a perfect bun because I kind of like messy buns so if you just pull some of the hair out it gets a little messy there and there you go so then I just take this hair on the side and kind of make it a little bit bigger and voila so you can make it however big you want it to be I um, wet it this morning and I didn't really touch it I just let it dry how it did and I went like that a little bit but when I have the top bun part up I like to make it bigger and yeah and cue the braider she braids it a certain way so you can't see like as y'all can see that's the party and the braid for the sewing starts there but the way she does it she kind of has it going forward so she does her little special cool thing and voila you have the original style so this is the original style I did wear this style um, on my birthday dinner and I have a picture right here for you so I wore it like that for my birthday dinner and then when I went out the next night I had it down um, and I had it down the other day and now I'm putting it back up so none of my hair is left out this is the perfect hairstyle if you don't want any of your hair left out but you still like want you know hair <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense but yeah so uh, this is the original hairstyle so uh, um back to her hair company like this hair is bomb like I said before I always get so many questions on what hair did you use and I use this hair from her hair company the curly hair and what I really like about them is their customer service is great and they have like real-time shipping so I don't know about y'all but I am like obsessed when I get a package like if I know a package is coming like right when I hit like complete order or submit or purchase or whatever I want to know what exactly is going on so they send you a real-time tracking thing so you know exactly where it is and all that so I think that is amazing and their shipping is super super fast and yeah I just love hair, her hair company I'll link the other videos um, that I have of her hair company below um, I have some more curly reviews I have kinky curly um, and I think I have body wave too I tried that one but I love all their hairs they're affordable they have bundle deals and the hair is just bomb like this like I don't know y'all have to touch it like touch the hair touch the hair Oh, I just get so many compliments on it and I love it so much. So those are all the products I use. Um, I gave you how many inches I had. So I have three bundles of 20 inches. I'll link the link to this hair below so you guys can get it because y'all should. Especially since it's getting warm out. And you know you want your curly hair to be free and you know all that. And it does blend great with your natural hair. Um, cause I do blend it with my hair when I do wear it in the wigs. I use the perm rods to blend it and I have a video on that too. I'll link that below. But yeah, so this hair's bomb. Please let me know, let me know if you have any more questions. Um, let me turn around so you guys can like see what it looks like. So it comes down to like there. Um, yeah. This hair is just like the bomb diggity. 
it's so cute oh yeah and yes you guys I do have on lashes y'all should be so proud of me I knew this 28th year would be special because I finally know how to put eyelashes on I did not know before that's why I never wore eyelashes and I think I'm about to be obsessed with them because I like the way they look I know how to put them on it's just ooh. anywho enough rambling um yes I'll leave all the info below please let me know how you like the hair if you have any more questions let me know and I'll see you in my next video and shout out to all the Aries out there happy birthday March and April babies bye bye